Have y'all heard of a blues singer named Coco Taylor? If not, listen up, here we go. Coco Taylor, also known as the queen of the blues, was one of the most electrifying female blues singers in history. Her real name is Cora Anna Walton, but she took the nickname Coco because she loved chocolate. She was born near Memphis, Tennessee and grew up picking cotton, but she spent Sunday singing gospel in church. Her father told her not to listen to blues music because it was the devil's music, but she couldn't resist. She listened to blues singers like Memphis Minnie and a young B.B. King who had his own radio show. She sung with her siblings as they played homemade instruments. Can you believe her brother made a harmonica out of corn? <laughs> Coco moved to Chicago at the age of 21 with 35 cents and a box of Ritz crackers with her husband, Robert Pops Taylor. She would clean houses during the day and sing blues at night. She got a big break when Willie Dixon saw her perform one night and he signed her to Chess Records. He wrote her number one hit song, Wang Dang Doodle. Coco won 29 Blues Awards and had eight Grammy nominations and won a Grammy for her guest spot on the Blues Explosion album. She's a true blues legend. I recently paid tribute to Coco and did a version of Voodoo Woman if you want to check it out.